What's up everybody and welcome back to Timothy Hannock. Today I'm going to tell you guys what is going on because I haven't been posting videos and I know a lot of you are like, hey when's part 2 of um, Crash Royal going to happen? Royal Crash or whatever you call it, however you call that na the, the game that I was playing for part 1. Um, I will be playing the games again. My stomach's feeling much better. Um, I did just wake up, <laughs> so uh, that's why my face is the way it is. It's in case you haven't noticed that I look a little weird. Um, I have myself a new girlfriend I found on Bumble. She's amazing. She's really sweet and kind. She has been through a lot. Um, not like the typical person, I would say. Uh, she's just been used a lot. Every time she tries to get into a relationship, they use her, and I understand where she's coming from, where she stands, how she feels, because I've been used my whole life. I've been taken advantage of my whole life. A lot of people don't even want to listen to me, and when I have to say something, it, I guess it do just doesn't seem believable until I actually prove it. So, I'm so used to proving things anyway. <laughs> so, when, I, when people threaten me and whatnot, I just tell them, okay, whatever, you know, talk to talk, but can you walk to walk, sort of thing, so, um, she calls herself Missy, that's the short version to it, uh, so, anyway, I'm, I'm actually pretty happy. Speaking of which, she just messaged me. <laughs> She's really happy. I, I can tell by her body language and stuff. I, I've learned how to read body language. I'm not sure if I've ever mentioned that in my earlier videos. But, yeah. Um, I'm going to have to make this video kind of short because for some reason I don't have that much memory on my phone. i got to go through my pictures and everything. Uh, I gotta get, I gotta delete a lot of stuff on my phone because of, uh, my ex. Um, the girl that was, she moved in with me and right off the bat she used me. I mean, she was constantly bringing people over. She doesn't seem to understand what she did wrong. I ended up blocking her from Facebook, well, at least the messenger part, because she could not seem to understand why I'm angry at her why I told her to come and pick up her crab and get the hell out for one you can't go on social media and say you're dating a married couple while already being in a relationship unless if you can agree to an open relationship and for those who don't know what an open relationship is an open relationship is when you and the person you are dating um, told you know you told each other that it's okay if you have sex with someone else it's okay if you kiss this other person but they just have to know about it that's an open relationship it is being honest with them one another and say hey I want to have a one night stand with this person and then you go ahead and say um all right but I don't do that okay there's a lot of people out there that do and they like that sort of thing but that's not me I'm a committed person I've tried a one night stand before. I don't like doing that. And I don't like using people for sex either. That's not who I am whatsoever. So I go with being in a relationship. I try my best and I end up getting shut down. I end up getting used. I end up getting hurt because I try so hard and these people just keep hurting me. Um, I don't know how this relationship is going to go. So far it's looking good, but that's how all relationships start. They all start good, but later on down the road, things do get harder. But you have to be able to stick by that person's side and be like, well, okay, you broke your leg and I'm going to have to help you for the next few months, you know, to get around, okay? Or can you do that? Are you willing to do that? Because marriage, marriage anymore, a lot of people don't even care. They just go out and do it. You should not be getting married just because you want the relationship to last. You shouldn't get married just because you have a kid. Now, it is typically an understandable 
uh, situation for most people to, you know, oh, well, I got this girl pregnant, I should probably marry her now. Um, no. Quite honestly, you should get to know her more and make sure she's going to make you happy. You got to be able to make her happy. And it's not all about sex, okay? Now, I, my definition of sex is making love, okay? Because it's a, it's a bond between two people. If, so if anybody in the comments want to say sex and making love is the same thing, I will argue with you all day on that. It's not. Sex is to please you. It's to take the hormones out of your system. Making love is like that, but different. How, you may ask. Well, let me say this. Making love is that bond. It, it, it's a special bondage, okay? Making love to someone is not just, oh, yeah, you know, getting all in there and crazy like. That's just sex and getting your crap out of your system. And I'm, I'm not trying to be funny to tell you the truth. Do, does it look like I'm laughing? No. Do I? Am I smiling? No. This is a serious situation. I've, I've, I've been through so many relationships now that, you know, I understand things a lot more. I'm a lot wiser than I probably, what most people my age should be. So, um, you know, it is what it is. But uh, as far as my YouTube channel goes, um, guys, I, I appreciate all 88 subscribers. So thank you all very, very much for being a part of that uh, subscribe thing. Um, and I'll say, I've said this before and I'll say it again. I don't care about popularity. I really don't. The money I get from YouTube, if I ever make any money from this, and money that I make from boxing is going to go through, you know, donations and my bills. I want to make sure that my uh, future family has what they need, a roof over their head, food on the table, stuff like that. And then the rest is going to you guys. I will have gift cards. I will give out movie codes, I'll do pretty much anything you guys want me to because you guys deserve it. You guys are subscribers. For the, I mean, if you subscribe to people, you're expecting videos. I know that. And I haven't been doing that because of uh, cancer and chemo and everything. Um, my stomach is feeling a lot better. The chemo's n probably no longer in my system. I'm not entirely sure, but my stomach ain't hurting no more. So I will be making videos. And... My wonderful girlfriend will be, in pro and probably she will be in some of my uh, later videos, just saying. But I will be making some videos of the games that you guys want me to play. I will be making a part two of that uh, Royal Clash or whatever that game's called. Um, I'm planning on making more than just one and two parts. Probably maybe, maybe up to five. Maybe more, I don't know. It all depends on what you guys want, what you think, what you guys feel is necessary. Um, basically, whatever you guys say goes. <laughs> uh, I'm just, I'm here for the entertainment. I'm here to help you guys. I'm here to make life a bit easier for you. Um, for those who are watching this and never seen my life story, there's eight parts to that. Please go down and look those up. Um... Because that has helped one person stop themselves from killing themselves. So that is a big thing for me. Uh, I have many other videos that I have. Like uh, eating a Whopper burrito which has 1700 views. And food challenges, eggnog challenge, stuff like that. So... I try to live, you know, I try to live my life to the fullest, uh, especially now, after, considering I'm done with chemo. Um, I will be, on January 2nd, 2019, I will be going to get my results. I will let you guys know how the, how all that goes. And, uh, I think that's pretty much all I gotta say. I hope I didn't repeat myself too much because I know I do that a lot. But, um, yeah. I'm going to try to make some better videos. I'll tell you guys to you know what's going on with my life. Oh, I will be do going back to my working out. I can't do much with the port still in my chest here. 
but as far like push up wise I can't do push ups right now. But I will show you guys, you know, my shadow boxing, I can do some of that. And I will be doing, you know, just other things to and show you guys what I'm doing, you know. Um and how I do it. So you guys may be able to learn a few things about boxing. You get you guys get to see me get back into shape, so that's something I really wanted to get out there to you guys. Um that's about it, everyone. That's pretty much all the time I really got until I delete some pictures and videos. So, anyway, thank you so much for subscribing to me. I, I wouldn't be much of a YouTuber if it wasn't for you guys. I will be getting back to these games. And as far as the Z moves go, someone commented on a video before and asked if I knew anything about it. I'm still trying to figure it out. So, if anybody can tell me how to use a Z move. I would appreciate it. I do have one Mega Pokemon. So, and you have to have a Mega Evolution Pokemon in order to use them. So, I ha still have to, you know, work on that. Once I figure it out, either through somebody else or figuring it out on my own, I will make sure I make a video about it. So, until then, peace everybody.